Primavera Unifier utilizes the vendor pre-qualification request to pre-qualify vendors before they're added to the master vendor list. To utilize this business process, we first have to enter the vendor information, then send this for a sequential approval by each of the divisions within the company. For this example, we will be seeing the financial, safety, and construction divisions. We then pre-qualify the vendor with the final approval stage. And if they meet all requirements, a new vendor will be created in the master vendor list. Here we will be using a sequential approval vendor pre-qualification request. We will start at the vendor input form with the vendor information already inputted and proceeds through the approval process. Information on each of the financial, health and safety and construction approval forms will be confidential to those forms. The final approval, however, will be able to see the information entered in the financial, health and safety and construction approval steps. With that information, they will be able to assess the quality of the vendor and either approve or reject that vendor. From the vendor input form, once all the information has been entered, the form can be sent to the pre-vet team for approval. The pre-vet team will review the vendor information entered in the upper form and the line items. From here, the pre-vet team will select a workflow action and this will be to send for the financial approval. This will be the first step in the sequential approval process. The financial team will assess the information in the upper form and in the line items. Once they have done this, they will enter a approval rating in the upper form. Here they have entered a financial rating of 10. Now they will select the workflow action to send for safety approval. This will be the next step in the approval process. Like the financial department, the health and safety department will review the information in the upper form and light items and enter a approval rating in the health and safety rating. Here they have given an approval rating of 10. They will then send for construction approval. The construction approval team will now look at the information in the upper form and line items and will assess the vendor's quality. Once again, the construction team cannot review the information entered by the financial team, nor can they see the financial information in the upper form or line items. Here they have entered a construction rating of 10. They will now select to send this for a final approval. In the final approval stage, all vendor information and line items are visible in the form. The individual division ratings are also visible. Note that here they cannot be edited. For overall approval, a rating will be given. Here they have given a rating of 9, and the vendor will be approved. When the vendor pre-qualification has been approved, a new entry in the vendor master list will be created. The vendor information will be auto-populated from that vendor pre-qualification request. Here we see the vendor name, type, ID, and overall rating have been auto-populated. For more information on the vendor pre-qualification request and other business processes, please contact Emerald Associates.